Hi, George Martin here with Tennis for the Body, and today we're going to be working on the second element of the high-level serve. The second element is how you use your arm. Now, in the past, they told you to extend. Well, guess what? There's a rotator cuff inside your shoulder. If you extend your rotator, you're going to destroy it. Okay? You're going to end up having to have surgery. You won't be able to play tennis. It'll be no fun. High-level serve, the arm should rotate and unfold and fold. If it's a basic serve, they're just going to toss it and tap it. For the high level serve, when you throw a ball, which is what they say it's like, there's two ways to take it back. You can take it back down here, which is like you're in the outfield, and then you Or you can take it back like you're in the infield and then throw. But your arm is bent. Your arm does not hyperextend. It rotates, and then as the rotation happens, your arm unfolds as it needs to. It is not hyperextended. That is not how you throw. You throw this way. Watch a baseball pitcher. That's how they do it. Okay? So if you're serving, your arm should be doing the same thing. Watch my elbow. Watch my arm. Watch my wrist. And then to relieve the tension, your arm finishes. It doesn't just stop, okay? If your arm stops, you end up putting pressure on the shoulder again, damaging your body. We don't want to do that. That's why this is called tennis for the body. Okay? So, learn to use your arm properly so that you can get the most racket speed out of your arm. All right? Did you see that? You'll be seeing some videos of hitting as well. Take care. Subscribe. I'll see you soon. Look forward to the next video.